Just like human beings, different dog breeds have different moods, temperaments, and life patterns. Considering all these factors is crucial, especially when you're a senior or retiree. Believe me, dogs require a lot of effort and care, which you may not want to cope with once you retire. So, when selecting a breed, it's essential to evaluate the greatest match for both you and the dog. Here are the 25 worst dog breeds for seniors and retires that you should never get. So let's get started. Number 25, Australian Shepherds. Easily bored with extraordinarily high energy levels, Australian Shepherds need an active lifestyle. They're a herding breed after all, and were bred for life on a farm. Sometimes prone to anxiety and quick to take out frustration with redirected aggression, this is not an appropriate breed for a senior. Number 24, Jack Russell Terrier. Jack Russells are easily one of the most high energy terrier breeds, and they're known to be mouthy, alert, and reactive. These little dogs are fierce and not only require lots of exercise, but also are not interested in being lap dogs. Number 23, Caucasian Shepherd. Caucasian Shepherds are large dogs that originate from the Russian region of the Caucasus. They were developed to protect flocks and one's property from wolves and other wild animals. They are protective of their owners and can develop challenging behavioral problems. Therefore, they need an experienced owner and early training. Caucasian Shepherds are in the category of dangerous dogs in many countries outside Russia, and they have also been banned or restricted in many others. As you can see, this makes them less than ideal for seniors. Number 22, Border Collie. The ultimate canine athlete, the Border Collie is a breed of herding dog known for its intense focus and incredible intelligence. Their large, expressive eyes make them look alert and attentive at all times. While their little build and lively gait give them the perfect combination of speed and agility. These sleek, athletic creatures require loads of exercise a day and will likely run a senior to the ground. Border Collies are a tricky breed to have and will only do well in super active households that can provide an hour or two of intense exercise a day. Not only do they need plenty of mental stimulation and regular physical exercise, but they require diligent socialization while they grow up to ensure they remain well-mannered when fully grown. Although the loyalty and bond between a Border Collie and his owner can be unrivaled, elderly individuals must consider their practical limitations before welcoming one of them into their home. Number 21, German Shepherd. German Shepherds can be an incredible companion for active, enthusiastic owners, but for senior owners, they may not be the top choice. These clever workaholic dogs are incredibly energetic and require intense physical and mental stimulation. They need tons of exercise and attention throughout the day, which may be challenging for older individuals to keep up with. Plus, keeping German Shepherds well-trained may require more patience than some seniors possess. In addition, they often have high prey drives, and a badly trained German Shepherd could pull a senior around during a walk if a squirrel suddenly decides to dash past. Number 20, Dalmatian. Dalmatians are known for their high energy levels. They are historically carriage dogs and have a history of being active and agile. This means they need regular exercise and mental stimulation to stay happy and healthy. Seniors who may not be able to provide the necessary daily activities might find the Dalmatian to be too demanding. Dalmatians require a lot of physical activity. Regular walks and playtime are crucial to prevent boredom and potential behavioral issues. Seniors who may have physical limitations might find it challenging to meet the exercise needs of a Dalmatian. While Dalmatians have short coats, they do shed, and regular grooming is required to manage this. Seniors who are unable to handle grooming or have allergies might find this breed shedding to be problematic. Number 18, Standard Poodle. Standard Poodles are highly intelligent and energetic dogs. They were originally bred as water retrievers and their intelligence requires regular mental stimulation and physical exercise. Seniors who may have limitations in providing the necessary mental and physical activities might find standard poodles to be high maintenance in this regard. Standard poodles need a significant amount of daily exercise to keep them happy and healthy. They thrive on activities like walking, running, and playtime. Seniors with mobility issues or those who prefer a more low-key companion may find it challenging to meet the exercise needs of a standard poodle. 
While standard poodles have a hypoallergenic coat that doesn't shed much, they require regular grooming to maintain their unique hairstyle. This includes brushing, trimming, and potentially professional grooming. Seniors who are not able to handle the grooming needs or are looking for a low-maintenance dog may find the standard poodle's coat care to be demanding. Number 17. St. Bernard St. Bernards are loyal and undeniably sweet, but they're probably not the best choice for senior dog owners. They require a lot of exercise, making it difficult for those who need to limit their physical activity. They are also large dogs that can easily drag the owner around during a walk or knock a senior down at home. Plus, these big dogs are known to drool, and seniors might not appreciate the mess. Not only that, St. Bernards need guidance and firm leadership during training sessions to reach their full potential as family pets, which can be a challenge for older generations already busy handling their own life matters. Number 16. Shih Tzus Shih Tzus have a long, flowing coat that requires regular grooming to prevent matting and maintain their overall health. Seniors who may have difficulty with grooming tasks or those seeking a low-maintenance pet might find the grooming needs of a Shih Tzu to be challenging. While the small size of Shih Tzus can be an advantage for some seniors, it can also be a consideration for those who may have mobility issues or concerns about accidentally injuring a small dog. Number 15. Siberian Huskies Siberian Huskies are a highly energetic and active breed. They were originally bred as working sled dogs, and they require a significant amount of exercise and mental stimulation. Seniors who may have limited mobility or prefer a more laid-back pet might find it challenging to meet the exercise needs of a Siberian Husky. Siberian Huskies have a strong prey drive, which means they may be prone to chasing after smaller animals. This can be a consideration for seniors who may have other pets or live in areas with abundant wildlife. Siberian Huskies are adapted to cold climates and may not tolerate hot weather well. Seniors living in warmer climates should consider the potential challenges associated with managing a dog with a thick coat and high temperatures. Number 14. Boxer Boxers are known for their exuberant and playful nature, coupled with high energy levels. They require regular exercise, mental stimulation, and playtime to stay happy and healthy. Seniors who may not have the physical stamina or time to meet the energetic needs of a boxer might find them to be too demanding. Boxers are intelligent dogs, but they can also be somewhat stubborn. Consistent and positive training is essential to manage their strong and sometimes headstrong nature. Seniors who may not have experience with dog training or those seeking a more easily trainable dog might find boxers to be less suitable. Number 13. Akita Akitas are a large and robust breed. Handling a strong and powerful dog can be challenging, especially for seniors who may have physical limitations or difficulty managing a larger dog. Akitas are known for their independent nature. They may not always be as eager to please as some other breeds, which can make training more challenging. Seniors who prefer a more obedient or easily trainable dog might find the Akita's independence to be demanding. Akitas have a natural guarding instinct and can be reserved or aloof with strangers. While this makes them excellent protectors, it may not be ideal for seniors who want a more sociable or easily approachable dog. Number 12. Belgian Malinois Belgian Malinois have a strong work drive and often need a job to do. They thrive when given tasks and activities that engage their minds. Seniors who may not be able to provide these tasks might find it challenging to meet the breed's need for purposeful activity. Belgian Malinois may have strong guarding instincts, which can lead to reserved or protective behavior around strangers. Seniors who desire a more social and easily approachable dog may find the Malinois less suitable. Belgian Malinois are medium to large dogs with a strong build. Handling a dog of this size and strength can be physically demanding especially for seniors with limited strength or mobility. Number 11. Chow 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 Chows are known for their independent and aloof nature. Seniors who are seeking a more affectionate and interactive companion might find the Chow Chow's independent nature to be less fulfilling. Chow Chows can be reserved and sometimes protective, making them wary of strangers. Proper socialization is crucial to ensure they are well behaved around new people and situations. Seniors who have limited mobility or those who may not be able to invest time in consistent socialization might find the Chow Chow's temperament challenging. 
Chow Chows have a thick double coat that requires regular grooming to prevent matting and maintain skin health. Seniors who are looking for a low-maintenance dog or who may have difficulty with grooming tasks might find the grooming needs of a Chow Chow to be demanding. Number 10, Pomeranian. Pomeranians are a small toy breed known for their lively and extroverted personalities, but some of the reasons why a Pomeranian might be considered less suitable for seniors. Pomeranians are generally energetic dogs. While their size makes them manageable, they may require more activity and playtime than some seniors can provide. Pomeranians are known for their bold and confident personalities. While this can make them delightful companions, it may be challenging for seniors who prefer a more laid-back or predictable pet. Pomeranians can be quite vocal, and they may bark or vocalize frequently. This may not be suitable for seniors living in environments where excessive noise could be an issue. Number 9. English Bulldog English Bulldogs might present challenges for some seniors. Bulldogs are sensitive to extreme temperatures, especially heat, because of their short noses. Seniors may need to take extra precautions to ensure their Bulldog is comfortable in various weather conditions. Bulldogs have wrinkled skin, especially around their face, which requires regular cleaning and care. Seniors who may have difficulty with routine grooming or who are looking for a low-maintenance dog might find the care needs of an English Bulldog to be demanding. Bulldogs can be known for their stubbornness, making training a bit challenging. Consistent and patient training is essential to manage their behavior. Seniors who may not have experience with dog training or those seeking a more easily trainable dog might find Bulldogs to be less suitable. Number 8 Australian Cattle Dog Australian cattle dog are among the most intelligent dog breeds. While this intelligence makes them highly trainable, it also means they need regular mental stimulation to prevent boredom. Seniors who enjoy engaging with their dogs in activities like training and problem solving may find this aspect rewarding. Australian cattle dogs can be independent and may have a strong instinct to herd. This independence can make training more challenging, especially for those who prefer a more obedient or easily trainable dog. Number 7 Bull Mastiff Bull Mastiffs are known for their protective nature. While this can be an asset in certain situations, it may lead to reserved or guarded behavior around strangers, which might not align with the desire for a more sociable dog. While not excessively energetic, Bull Mastiffs do require regular exercise to keep them healthy and mentally stimulated. Seniors who may not be able to provide consistent exercise might find the breed's needs challenging. Bull Mastiffs can be independent and may not always exhibit the same level of affection or sociability as some other breeds. Seniors who want a more affectionate or people-oriented dog might find the Bull Mastiff to be less suitable. Number 6 Basenji Basenjis are known for their independent nature. While they can be affectionate with their owners, they are not always as eager to please as some other breeds. This independence may make training more challenging, especially for those who prefer a more obedient and easily trainable dog. Basenjis can be aloof or reserved particularly around strangers. Seniors who are looking for a more social and outgoing companion might find the Basenji's reserved nature less fulfilling. Basenji's are intelligent but can be somewhat stubborn and willful. Training requires patience, consistency, and positive reinforcement. This breed may not be the best choice for someone who is not willing to invest time and effort in training. Number 5 Doberman Dobermans are known for their loyalty and protective nature. While this can be an asset in certain situations, it may lead to reserved or guarded behavior around strangers, which might not align with the desire for a more sociable dog. Dobermans are an energetic breed that requires regular exercise and mental stimulation. Seniors who may have limited mobility or prefer a less active dog might find it challenging to meet the exercise needs of a Doberman. Number 4 Pitbull Do we really need to include this dog on the list since it is so obvious to so many people? Though there are owners that swear to the gentleness of a well-trained pit bull, it is all about the general temperament of the breed, which is aggressive. They require a strong mastery, otherwise they will be very difficult to handle. This is definitely not a dog to choose as a new dog owner or one that lives in an apartment, as they need their out time, lest they feel cooped up and begin to act out aggressively. Number 3 Rottweiler Rottweilers are known as guardians. They never compromise on strangers and attackers. If they smell any, they are very tough to control while on a chain. However, they should always be kept on a chain. They might become highly aggressive, which makes them a worse dog breed for seniors. Number 2 Cane Corso A lot of breeds have made this list because they require huge amounts of exercise every day. The Cane Corso is not an overly active breed, although he does still require some daily exercise. 
He will enjoy walks more than runs, but several other factors mean he is not considered suitable for seniors. Number one, Corgi. These darling dogs are tiny munchkins that let you feel like they are your baby, but they are extremely active and destructive. On top of that, they demand a lot of care. Though we admire their dedication, they may not be appropriate in your older years, so you should never get all of these dogs if you're a senior citizen.